Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to another Brighton video. As I said in my main city vlog quite a while ago now, but the vlog that falls the next uh, the new Premier League season is coming up. So I thought as always I'll do another shirt review. This time, if you remember from last season, it's worked out a bit different as you can tell by the picture behind me. This time it's a away shirt, not the home shirt, but if you do remember from last season, it was the home shirt review, not the away one, because I didn't like the away one. This year it's the opposite, I don't like the away one, I don't like the home one, I like the away one. But anyway guys, let's get straight to this video, sorry for a bit of a long intro. But anyway guys, you know what to do, give it a little big front thumbs up if you enjoy it, subscribe for more, thanks for watching and let's go. So the away top for the new Premier League season for Brighton and Live Albion. It is a really nice top. I'm just going to grab it. Uh, here it is. It's the peppermint green. I'm not sure how well that would be showing up on camera, but that is the peppermint green. Um, the, the Brighton badge there, it's really nice. Black and white. The f last time I think we saw it black and white, um, and please excuse me if I'm on Brighton fans, is when we had the black shirt a few years ago. Uh, the, black, the black shirt and we, the badge was black and white. But... And this one, for the first time ever, I'll keep doing stuff for the first time ever on this channel as well. I've got it fully kitted out with everything from my nickname on the back, which is obviously Sport. I'll get that better for you. There you go. Um, and then, obviously, 7, the only bit that's missing from the channel name is the FC. And that's purely because I don't really want it on out. I think it might look a bit wrong. And, you know, I only get one chance. So that's why I stuck with the Sport 7 FC. But as you can tell, and obviously you can go and tell, anyway, I've got the uh, sponsor sleeve logo on this year's as well. The lining on the shirt is really, I do like the lining, um, and we'll go more to the back in a minute. And on this side, it's the Premier League logo. And really it's just because, you know, I really did like the shirt this year. I thought, you know what, I ain't got the home one, so I've got to get the away one. The black tick on the front as well and then uh, obviously the main sponsor American Express hold on try and get a better for you there you go um obviously in black as well the lining down the back I really do like or down the sleeve I should have called it yes it's down the sleeve it's not purely down the back but it some of it is on the back um but yeah really nice lining green and black lining um down the sleeve and yeah, there is slightly bits on the back um, with the lining uh, just there. I'm not sure how well you can see that, but that is the bit of the lining. Obviously, you know what we're going to do now? We're going to try it on, going to tell you how it feels. Are you looking forward to the new Premier League season? And even if you're not a new Premier, uh, Brighton fan, are you looking forward to the new Premier League season? Because I know I've got fans who support all different clubs on my channel. And I am really am looking forward to the new season. Plus vlogs, plus my Premier League predictions will be making a comeback as well. So, you know, as I said, I want to get this top on. I want to tell you how it feels. Tell you what it feels like. You know, about the space and that. I am not think it's quite engineered as well. But we're going to check out anyway. So let's get the top on now. So here I am with the new Brighton away top for the 2020... No, 2021 season slash 22 um about the sleeve and the logo on the arm they've actually printed it this year i'm not sure how many of you will remember the fact of the first ever season we could have the logos obviously but we couldn't have it printed if you know what i mean like it was actually got like, stuck on and you can actually feel it but this side it feels printed on and the same as the premier league logo obviously the fifth premier league season for brighton as well as I said, Premier League predictions and vlogs will be coming back for the following season. How does it feel? It feels really nice. As I said, I don't think it's really engineered. Um, you know, from a, like the few seasons ago. This is actually not too tight, but not too baggy. Um, if I'm being honest, how I like my shirts. Um, it is a bit baggy, but not too baggy. So, you know, it's one of them things. But a really good... Uh, engineering by Brighton, probably one of our best away tops uh, over the past five, six years that we bought out. As I said, the black and white Brighton badge you can see on here, 
uh, and obviously you can see the logo as well slightly the black tick as i said just not very well engineered i'm not sure whether the players have had a word with the uh, designers or you know who does the kits at brighton life Albion. but hey ho we go on um obviously brighton's first game's away to burnley more than likely i won't be traveling but i'll let you know when i'll do the premier League predictions closer near the time but anyway guys as i said i'd like to thank you for all your support especially during the year 2020 as well we're not going to get into discussion about that in this video but if you want to get a discussion please let me know in the comments below but anyway guys i'm going to bring this video to an end so guys you know what to do give it a big thumbs up if you enjoy it subscribe for more thanks for watching ciao for now